Mm, yeah, you can. You told him? Yeah, Mike, I did. Because Rachel trusted me to put this wedding together, and it wouldn't have felt like a celebration without Harvey. Thanks, Donna. See you up there. Yeah. <sighs> Just in time. I didn't think you were going to be able to make it. What can I say? I like to make an entrance. It's going to be awkward when my real best man shows up. Oh, I think it's clear who the best man is. Mm. Okay, maybe. Mm. Good. I'm the best. Hey. You ready for this? Yeah, I am. I think you are too. From the first second I met you, I knew I wanted to be here with you someday. Walking down the aisle, arm in arm. You got my head spinning, no kidding. I can't pin you down. I know that I fought it at first, but now, Mike, I can't imagine living alongside anyone else for the rest of my life. And I'm so dizzy, don't know what hit me, but I'll be all if I've learned one thing, it's that we never know what the future holds. And that can be a scary thing. But I know that there is nothing that I can't handle when I have you by my side. You are the strongest man I've ever met. And you make me stronger. You're the husband I've always wanted. And I can't wait to begin our adventure together. To you, Michael James Ross, Take Rachel Elizabeth Zane to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. And do you, Rachel, take Michael to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. And I now pronounce you man and wife. Of me And you give me all Of you I gotta say, Mike, those were some beautiful vows, especially the part about family. Thanks, Harvey. And I didn't get to say it before, but I'm really glad you made it. Me too. But I should be the one who's saying thank you. You saved the firm. Harvey, and before you say anything, let me just say I was wrong. Your senior partner material, you are ready. And when you come back from your honeymoon, we're not coming back, Mike, Harvey. Rachel and I were offered a chance to run a firm in Seattle. It's a, it's a place that only takes class action cases against Fortune 500 companies. And how we decided to go for it. Mike, Harvey, when Donna came to me, told me the firm was in trouble, I did exactly what I told you I would, but I don't ever want to have to make a choice like that again. You don't have to. If you want to do more pro bono cases... It's not the point, Harvey, and you know it. This is who I am. It's who I've always been. It's time, Harvey. It's time.